Good morning, friends, and welcome to Vlogmas Day 8. It is 4.30 in the morning. I slept 40 minutes on the couch. It's going to be a really tough day. I'm making some hot chocolate, the Williams Sonoma mocha. I'm using my favorite Smeg frother. It does lattes, cappuccinos, hot chocolate, all the things. The good thing about not sleeping is I've done all my laundry. Everything is put away. I even did the laundry that I had left in my closet from before I left. So my laundry's done for the weekend but it's going to be a tough day. I'm gonna get through as much as I can and all the things. I cannot wait for this hot chocolate. Also, I drove back with a rosemary tree in my car from Whole Foods because my Trader Joe's didn't have them this year. So, I have that. I'm going to enjoy this hot chocolate and try to calibrate myself for this day in some way. It is 5 a.m. and I told you that I had bought lights for this garland, so I went ahead and put it on. I mean, it just has made it even more beautiful. So, yeah, one thing off my to-do list as well. So, I have been home for a little bit and I told you and showed you this morning I put the lights in so today I added the burgundy ribbon look how beautiful it looks and the burgundy like exactly matches and then I just did some tails coming out in certain spots but it is it's so pretty and then I did this as well. I truly now think this is done. We have yoga starting in about 30 minutes. I have to get some yoga gear on, but I got a really great delivery. And then I got a delivery from Cloth and Paper. It's really just a bunch of pens. I'm not sure I understand. It's a bunch of pens, and then I got some clips, and then some new dividers. So I'm really happy. She also sent it in this like beautiful cloth bag. And then I had ordered this watch band a while ago, and I really, really like it. A company called Romis, Remis, and I love it. The quality is so high, thrilled with it. Bubby just ate dinner. His sister went to school today to get rid of some energy. Daddy is bringing home pizza for dinner. And yeah, I'll be doing yoga with Laura. It's just something that speaks to my heart and speaks to the way that I like to move my body. And when I thought about everything that Chris does for the holiday season in December through <laughs> through a vlog with, or the advent calendar of kindness and the advent calendar of self-care, um, he's a really special person, Christopher, because he was so intentional with pairing a self-care focus with a kindness focus. And when I consider self-care, I visualize two cups, right? One for me and one for everybody else that I care about. And if I don't fill up my cup with a little bit of something, I'll never be able to pour and show kindness to anybody else. And so today, this time together is about filling up your cup a little bit for the self-care that you can go and shop. So, I just finished yoga with all of you guys. It was so much fun, and now we're gonna have pizza and wine. 
How was your day, babe? Uh, it was good, actually. I had a, three victories in court. Great. So it was um, three different kinds of people that you wouldn't nor normally put in the same room. He actually had a good day because Mabel was at school today. I know, he, his, his little sister wasn't here to bother him. <laughs> but, no. She just peed on the rug. She came inside after being at school all day and ran around the house on the outside and <laughs> He is very upset about it. I know. Laura, like... I think he thought you were gonna smack him. No. <laughs> he like was, Flint. He, he Laura um, did such a good job. It was so awesome, and it was so much fun to spend time with people. All right, I'm gonna eat some dinner. I haven't eaten yet today. I really have slacked on the puzzle. That is going to be a weekend task. This one will start the 14th. So. Day nine. It is a complexion corrector. Pour some sugar on me. This calendar is such a treat each night. I love it so much. They have like an outrageously expensive one. These are pink diamonds. Um, but they have like a very expensive one. I think it was like a carousel this year. That was super fancy. Okay. Day nine. Oh, here we go. We got the fragrance Orphean. Day nine. Aw, we got some trees. I definitely have to move this tomorrow so we get it in a better spot because there's just not enough room. Day nine for sex. It's a Tom Ford lip color. So once again, another thing to gift someone. Oh, someone commented like, you must still be mad at Dolly because she can't be with the other advent calendars. I didn't even equate that. For some reason, I just put her in the pantry last year. Um, I think Sugarfina was also in the pantry last year. So we're not like disparaging Dolly. We're not like relegating her to the pantry. It was really not a thing that I thought about, but quite funny. Oh, a chocolate star. The chocolate was really high quality and really good. I'll definitely have that with my glass of wine tonight. Also, we forgot to sing to her. Two doors down, they're laughing and drinking and having a party, but two doors down, they're not aware that I'm around. I think for the remaining days of Vlogmas, I have to sing a different Dolly Parton song I cannot repeat, starting today. All right, Steven promised me that I could show his gifts tonight and that he wouldn't be watching. So, Steven, if you're watching this right now, turn it off. We'll wait because I wanted to show you guys what I got him for Christmas. Not all of his gifts have arrived. I'll let you know what I'm still waiting for, but let me show you what I've got him so far. So I got this really cute treat container that is actually a fire hydrant. I just thought it was too cute. He will love it. Um, this is like something he would totally dig, um, but never get for himself and the dogs. So I got him that. So one of the coffee table books that I got him was, because we also know that he loves dogs, this dog by Tim Flack. Um, the photos are just unbelievable, and I know he will love it so much. Then he likes a sleep mask. When we're traveling, even sometimes in bed, if I'm reading and my light is on. So I got him a really good slip, pure silk slip mask. This is called fun um this is called function a bento stack. And it charges. So you can charge this, it charges wirelessly, you can plug into it, but it also allows you five levels when you're traveling to stack your iPods, 
you, um, to stack, stack your charging bricks, your watch bands, your Apple Pencil, your cords, your eye, your AirPods, everything. But also it will hold power itself. So I thought that was a really cool travel gift. Oasis Modern Desert Homes, because he loves the desert. I also got him my tiny atlas. He loves atlases. So I got him like this travel journal that he can like personalize and make his own. Every Christmas I get him a Lego set. This one was outrageous. I think it was... It's like $200, but I got him the Star Wars something or other um, because he like he, he'll do Legos, but only around the holidays. Then I got him a clean tray. It's a UVC phone sanitizer. I thought he would love that. I have another package to show you, but some things that haven't arrived yet are I got him like five of his favorite J. Crew dress shirts and dress pants, and then he is always taking pictures of the dogs on walks, so I bought him a pair of Ray-Ban glasses that connect to his phone, but he can leave it in his pocket and you just tap the side, and whatever you're looking at, it takes like the highest quality picture or video. He can play music in them. They're by Ray-Ban. They're super fancy, um, and... I know he will absolutely love them. This is by a company called Modern Sprout. So they're Hydro Grow Kits, and this one is Aloe. This is a, bon a bonsai tree, and then I also got him a cactus. Steven just loves to grow things, so I thought this was like such a unique gift for him. So like I said, he has shirts coming, he has the glasses coming, and a couple other like little things, and then his stocking. Um, yeah, I'm like super excited, but try to think of some clever gifts for him this year. I will link what is still available, um, just so you can access it. But speaking of gifts and gift buying, tomorrow, friends, we are being hosted by a small business. This Saturday, I want to do some small business work and we are getting a private shopping event at one of my favorite small businesses. They're going to share some of their gifts and then you're going to see what I pick up as gifts while I'm there. And we're going to have a private shop and they're going to be there. They're going to be talking us through things. I'm super excited. Um, and it's one of the things that I've been working on behind the scenes and super excited to have like a private shop where we can just film and enjoy the company of others and support a small business. Everything will be available online, but I am so looking forward to it. They open at 10, but we're going in at 8.30 for an hour and a half of shopping. So more gift ideas coming tomorrow. In the meantime, I think I'm gonna wrap up this vlog for today because I need to get some sleep. Take care of yourself, take care of others, be kind, kindness is free, give it to everyone. Until next time, which will be tomorrow, bye-bye.